Yo, before this video starts, I am running two different giveaways. This first giveaway is new. To enter it, all you guys have to do is follow my Twitch. Once my Twitch hits 12k followers, I will pick and shoot somebody and send them a $10 PSN or Xbox gift code. And to increase your odds of winning that giveaway, you guys can send me proof of a screenshot that you follow my Twitch to my Instagram or Twitter. Link to those will be in the description down below. And then I run this giveaway on all of my videos as well. To enter, make sure you guys sub up, turn on personal notifications, and hit that like button. Also, comment down below your Instagram or Twitter and let me know if you're on PS4 or Xbox. If this video hits 500 likes, I will pick and choose somebody out of the comment section and send them a $10 PSN or Xbox gift code. But with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and get right into the video. Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy JR, and today's video, I got this little demigod glitch that you guys can take advantage of. Before I get into the video, I do wanna explain a few things with this glitch. The first part is, I do wanna give a shout out to Dan Dan because he, again, he was nice enough to let me use his footage. I'm on Xbox. He's on PS4, so I'm gonna leave his link down in the description down below. Make sure y'all boys go check out his video and also make sure you guys show his channel some love. And also he has all the files that I believe you guys need for this glitch in the description of his video. So that link again will be in the description down below. And also, like I said, I wanted to give a shout out to Dan Dan. The second part of this glitch is do this at your own discretion. Like if you accidentally mess this up, it is possible you could accidentally corrupt your players. You could delete you know your players on accident and not be able to get them back so again make sure that if you do this do it do this at your own discretion and then also i don't explain this the best that i can but again if you guys have any questions make sure you guys hit up dan dan go to his channel you can also hit him up on twitter um you should see his twitter on the bottom left hand side of this video anyway what this glitch allows you to do is it basically just allows you to transfer over files from a different player to your own and whenever you do that you're able to bringing the demigod glitch over to your account if you were unable to do it before it got it got patched so this also gives you the glitch tendency tendencies which allows you to dunk more it allows you to get more steel shoot better all that it, tendencies is what a lot of people do this glitch for and then in my career it makes all of the players in the in the nba 5-4 and it also makes you the the people on your team extremely tall as well you'll see by the, the clips in the video so yeah man i'm gonna go ahead and get right into the video i'm gonna try to explain it the best that i can if you and like i said if you have any questions you can also hit up dan dan and dan dan also has the files that you guys will need as well all right, so the first thing that I would advise you guys to do is copy over all of your files to USB or PS Plus or both. That way if the glitch goes wrong, your players get lost or whatever, you can always get them back. So you can go to upload to online storage, NBA 2K20 and just select all of your files. This is all your players, all that good stuff. And then you can hit upload. You can also copy all of your files over to your USB drive as well. So you just select on the, go to copy to system storage, USB, select on your USB drive and do the same as well. This just saves all your players. Now what you guys wanna do is delete all of the players. So go to uh, delete save data in system storage and then you guys can delete all of your micro files. Um, or you can only delete one, it's up to you, but in this video, he decided to delete all of them just to show you guys that the glitch is legit. So you can delete all of the micro files that you see and you guys can go ahead and hit delete. So the next thing that you guys wanna do is go to save data in system storage, go over to copy to USB system storage, select on the USB that you're using, NBA 2K20, and then you can select on any file that you have left. You can select on the my team file, user data, it really doesn't matter. I believe in this video, he selected on the, he select on the my team file. So you guys can go ahead and do that and that'll copy the file over to your USB drive. So next, you guys wanna plug your USB, after this gets done copying, you guys wanna plug up your USB from your PS4 over to your laptop or computer. You're gonna need a program called Save Wizard in order to do this. You can, I, I believe you have to buy it. I don't believe there's any free versions. So you are gonna need Save Wizard and don't get scammed by anybody in the comment section saying that they will do this for you because most people, most people will be lying anyway. But once you uh, open up your computer, Open up your PS4 uh, USB file drive and you guys will see the file that you have. So it'll say like a random number, like in this case, the file is 57E. And then you guys also wanna have the files from Dandan, from Dandan's video on your laptop already. 
And then from here, what you guys want to do is move over the files that you get from Denden over to your USB drive under the file that you saved from your PS4. So it's going to look like this right here. And then just keep in mind that the file that you save from your PS4 is going to be like the file 7. Your guys may be a different number, but it's going to look like this right here. And again, he goes kind of fast in this video, so if you need to slow it down, you can. And then next, what you guys want to do is go ahead and open up Save Wizard. Now, watch this part very carefully. Again, he does go kind of fast, so if you need to slow it down, you can. But um, open up the Save Wizard program. And then from here, what you guys want to do is go to... Um, you can go to my saves go to resign and then right here you're going to see the micro file 001 and then your my team file and then from here you want to select on the uh, my career 001 file and then you guys want to go ahead and hit resign so he'll do that here in one moment so that's the file that's going to have the glitch player so you guys want to go ahead and hit resign and then you have your own profile that you'll make his was dan dan yours can be named whatever and then select on your profile and then hit resign and whenever you do this right here it's basically going to copy over the new glitch demigod file over to your current file and then after it gets done you can close out a save wizard and then you guys can open up your usb drive select on your ps4 file and then select on that file 7 file and then go into it and you can see that now you have that my career 001 file which is a new glitch player under your my team file that we copied over at the beginning of the video so now go ahead plug your usb back into your um ps4 and then from here you guys want to open up your settings and you just want to copy the files you want to upload the file back over to your ps4 so go to settings and then you want to go to application save data management go to uh, save data on usb storage select on your usb that you use Select on NBA 2K20 and then copy over both of these files or actually you can only you can just copy over the new micro file go ahead and copy that over as you guys saw again I'm sorry but he does go really fast there's nothing I can do about it you guys can check out his video as well and once you do that go ahead reload the game back up so now as you guys will see right here he's going to select on the micro file on his micro tab and you can see it's saying NBA unknown and then for whatever reason this part right here he said it took a little while for his player to be re-downloaded back onto his ps4 so if you get this right here after you do the glitch don't freak out it, it's all right um just give it like he said it took 10 minutes for the player to finally load so i guess it can take a little bit of time so again but what I told you at the beginning of the video, if something goes wrong with this glitch, you guys can always get your players back as long as you save them over to your USB or PS Plus. So you're all good. You're all good and covered there. But like I said, whenever he done this glitch, it took a while for the player to be re-downloaded. But you're going to see right here. Now, this is the new glitch player right here. He done a center file. There's different files that he has. He has one for a center. He has one for a play shot. So the file that he done through um, the save wizard was I believe a playmaking shot creator. So he explained because he done a, done a playmaking shot creator file and replaced it over a center file that that's why he's a 60 overall with no badges. So he he did say that he had different files for different positions. So whenever you do this, you guys just want to look for the file that is closest to your player. Like if you have a playmaking shot creator. You're going to select on that file. If you have like a shooting center, you're going to select on that file. But you're going to see right here, he has all of his hotspots. So this gives you your hotspots. This gives you your glitch tendencies. All of, all of his tendencies are all the way up to 100, which is crazy. It, it's super OP. So, and then also, the main reason to do this is to get your, all of your hotspots. And, but most importantly, you get all of your tendencies. But you want to make sure that you do this on a player that um, that is close to your own my player whenever you look at your files but it doesn't really matter and now if you wanted to ground out this player right here he could and also all the players in the nba are going to be extremely short so it's going to be extremely easy for him to get his badges you'll see here in a moment whenever he actually loads up a my career game 
All the players are going to be super short. All their stats are going to be on zero. All the players aren't going to have any badges. It's just like the demigod glitch at the beginning of the year. But now in order to do it, you have to go through uh, this process right here. And you can see like when he's scrolling through all the players in the NBA, you can see that they're all extremely bad. And that's because and that's from the demigod glitch. So now whenever he goes, to, like if he was actually grind out this player, he would um, be able to get his badges extremely fast. But the best thing about this glitch, you see people all the time asking for it. It's the glitch tendencies. Like if you do a glitch tendency, if you do this like on a lie down, you're gonna get more steals. You're gonna, if you do this on like a slasher, you're gonna get more contact dunks. If you do it on a sharpshooter, you're gonna shoot better, all that. The glitch tendencies is where this is at. So that is one of the main reasons why a lot of people have been like trying to do this but it also works extremely well for my career so you can see right here he loads up the my career game you can see all the players are extremely short so if you need your badges you can you know finish around the room you can shoot our room you can throw lobs all that it's super easy it's very cheesy and it's just an extremely easy way to grind out your player and this is working as as a patch 10 this also only works on ps4 xbox isn't getting us the ability to copy over to usb so as far as i know this land works on ps4 it might work on pc or switch i have no idea i really don't know but um as far as i know it only works on piece uh, ps4 and then like i said you need that program called save wizard um but i'm sure though i'll try to delete comments but i'm sure there'll be people in the comment section trying to scam you guys so make sure you guys don't get scammed by any bums like i said if that does happen to you i'm not responsible for anything that happens with this glitch i'm not responsible if you lose your players all that i'm simply just showing you guys that this is an option that you guys can take advantage of so if you decide to do it you definitely can if you have any questions leave a comment down below i'll try to answer everybody the best that i can but um you guys might want to also hit up dan dan follow his twitter follow his youtube all that he should be able to help you guys with this glitch as well so yeah man let me know if you guys have any questions like i said this is you know super glitchy i'm not even gonna lie like getting the uh, tendencies getting all of your tendencies will make you uh, like a way better player in no cap it's super important and as far as i know the only way to get your tendencies up is through this glitch i don't think your tendencies go up whenever you play my career but that's all i have on day thank you guys so much for all the support drop a like drop a sub enter my giveaways i'm out peace